All right, Ole Miss and Auburn. What a great SEC game this is on paper. Auburn, two and a half point home favorite, 66 and a half the total uh, in this game. And the money's come in on Auburn uh, in this game. Uh, people starting to, uh, Bo Nix has been much better this year. We need to give him some sort of credit uh, because uh, his performance in the in the game before the bye week, and that's another thing I think people like. Auburn's got a bye week, extra time to prepare for Brian Harson and this Auburn coaching staff going into this game. But I'll tell you what, he's playing better. That 38-23 road win at Arkansas, he was throw, chucking the ball deep, accurately, big play, offense through the air. Nothing we've seen from Bo Nix in the past. So he's playing with a great deal of confidence right now. This is going to be a tough game here for Ole Miss, who bounced back. Uh, with a, well, I shouldn't say bounced back, but uh, you know, just barely beat Tennessee. Uh, they were much better last week against LSU, 31-17 win. Uh, at home. It's a good football game. I understand liking Auburn off the bye week for sure, but pick them up to two and a half. We'll see how this one goes. Uh, very high total in this game, uh, 66. Usually uh, with Mississippi, that's a low total. With Auburn, that's a high total. But look, this offense, and this is the best Bo Nix has looked. So maybe for that reason, we could still see the game go over the total. What do you think, Connor? Ole Miss and Auburn. Damn, the total is high. I mean, I want to take the under. I think Auburn's defense can maybe stop Old Miss a little bit. Old Miss defense has been pretty good. I, I know you, Bo Nix had a decent game against Arkansas, but I've seen this guy for too long, the mistakes he makes. So there's just the side I'm just going to pass um, at two and a half. I, you know, I still kind of lean Old Miss, but I, it'll, it won't be easy to go in there and win for sure.